My name is Wolf Fritz. I am the co-founder of Coop Himmelblau. I just came from a building site. Together with my partner, Markus Grosnik, and with the project architect and design architect, and a lot of co-workers, I have to say, we developed a building which shows international the dynamic approach of China's scientific development. You can read it in the way we organized it. Everything is flowing. Everything is moving, so to say. I would like to explain the project on hand of sketches. Not talking too much, but illustrating the ideas by drawing it with hand. The building itself is a scientific approach as well, because it's a very complex structure. We need to show the dynamic of the scientific development in China by putting a lot of functions into the roof creates a covered public space below the roof. And in the pit of the landscape, there are some very important learning structures. Cinema, audience uh, spaces. Here you can see the learning spots. You come into this landscape, going down, and there will be a lot of uh, audiences and cinemas where people can see movies about the experiments. And on top, there will be green. Green, which provokes a lot of good air. As I said, the landscape below the roof is a public space, a green public space. And the landscape is extending from the top of the pit to the landscape on the side of the whole building. I would like to lift the secret of the inside of this building. You can see the roof here, but on top there is a big exhibition space like a landscape where a lot of event spaces, interactive event spaces could take place. So when people come up, they can play around with all these models you can see, and uh, they can look to, to the classes of virtual reality in the next step of the development of science. So that the way through the building is like a Chinese, a three-dimensional Chinese garden um, where zones are differentiated by the content, meaning that there are spaces and zones which are educational, where people can learn what's going on in science. And on top, there are more the experimental event spaces where people can interact with the models. They can see. And in order to make the whole building to, uh, to an ecological building, we implant two towers which uh, clean the smoke, transfer it to good air, which is blown up from the uh, landscape to the roof so that people can relax in the clean air zone. The the two major, or three, let's say three major architectural interventions are the green, fresh air, public space below the roof, the roof as an experiment in terms of construction, and the third thing are two towers which are placed in close to the, uh, to the building, in the park, 
where the smog air is cleaned and the fresh air will come up through the landscape and creates a very convenient 